was working for a buddy of mine that had a show for movies.com. And uh, he was a host, and he was he let me know. He's like, dude, this weekend I'm going to be hosting the red carpet for Black Snake Moon at Sundance. And uh, and he's like, you and your uh, he's like you and your best friend Adam should come out for the weekend, and you can stay at my place in Utah. And we're like, fuck yeah, you know. So we bought plane tickets to Sundance, and we had no place to stay. My buddy wasn't coming there till that night, so we're just like, fuck it, we'll start drinking, pounding Red Bull vodkas the entire night. Uh, we leave like this private party at like three in the morning and as soon as I step out of this place yet I hadn't talked to my friend about where we were staying. We had no idea. I get out on the street in the middle of Main Street and I just start puking all over the street. We're just like chugging tequila and like chugging whiskey, no mixers, nothing. We were out to get fucked up. We go out again and just start boozing. We see a couple movies, we open bar, everything's open bar. So we're just like conti continue drinking and I'm wearing a Lacoste beanie and this girl comes up behind me and I don't see who she is and she says I'll fuck you if you can give me your beanie Whoa. and I turn around and it's like a 40 year old woman <laughs> and I'm just like no 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 I'm cool you know <laughs> and she's like what she's like I'll fuck you if you give me your beanie <laughs> and I was like nah alright so Adam and I go with this chick up to her table our table is right next to <laughs> Nelly and P. Diddy's table yeah. and then we start just popping <laughs> bottles of Dom at this table, like drinking Dom Perignon, fucking Nelly's like sitting right, or you know, the table right next to us. Well, I'm like so fucking out of it. I start saying the other girl's name while I'm having sex with my girlfriend, <laughs> Sam. I keep saying this other girl, girl's name while I'm like <laughs> fucking her. Yes. Come on, I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't even know this uh, at the time. And so we tell this girl, we're like, <laughs> we're, like, we have no idea what we're gonna do. It's already like 1.30 in the morning. We're like, we don't even know where we're going to stay tonight. We don't have our bags. Our phones are both dead. We don't have our chargers. And she's like, it's fine. We have a condo. Like, just come back to our place and crash. I'm laying on my back and I'm like, just like thrown up. It's, it's a miracle that I didn't like choke to death and die because, yeah. Because I was just like, vomit was all over me. And I was just like gurgling, just like laying on my back, just gurgling in my own vomit. It's like, what are you guys doing here? And we're like, oh, you know, well, your, your roommate said we could just crash on the floor. And she's like, oh, oh, let me check with her. And she goes back in the room, and then the original girl who said we could stay there comes out, and she's like, you guys got to leave. And we're like, what? We don't even know where the hell we are. We ended up getting kicked out of this girl's place. We walk outside, and it's completely pitch black everywhere. There's no lights. There's just, like, lines of condos. Cold. There's one, you know, it's negative degrees outside. I mean, we're both hammered. And there's just one single dark road leading, you know, to could have been leading to fucking Narnia for all we knew. And so here I am, like naked, not knowing what the fuck's going on, in a shower, and everyone's telling me that I did this. And he's like, yeah, he's like, I talked to her today. It's funny, she told me she ran into you guys. She thought you guys stole her camera, so she kicked her out of your place. Ugh. And they're like, you gotta be shitting me. And he's like, yeah, man, that girl's a fucking cunt. <laughs> so we got kicked out of this girl's place all on the assumption that we stole her camera. We did, we did the entire weekend of Sundance with the clothes we were wearing on our backs. I didn't change clothes the entire three days we were at the Sundance Film Festival yes. or do anything, but oh it was one of the craziest She probably kicked you out because you smelled like shit. Maybe. <laughs>